Hello tribe, it's Brigitte with another pick a card reading and I was thinking to jump ahead and do December reading for you guys because now I'm doing the um, pick your future the next seven days so I think I'm gonna do it weekly so for November I would like to do those but let's take a sneak peek to December what you can expect what's coming whatever is gonna come through guys so as usual pick from my intuitive deck I'm gonna zoom into your cards pile number one over here pile number two pile number three and um, if you have heard the number before picking before looking at the cards visually it's better if you choose the number that was in your head or maybe you can choose the one you like visually and the one that you had in your head, okay? So I will see you in piles. Hello people who have chosen this intuitive card over here. We're gonna take a look at what December has for you. So let's get into business. I have pulled quite a bit of cards, but we're gonna pull some more, I think. <laughs> what I do see happening in December, it seems like there is going to be a moment for you that's for intuitives and for those who are not working in this field or not necessarily working, who's not interested in this field, that say doing it yourself when it comes to practicing um, spiritual work, anything to do with tarot anything to do with uh, mediumship, astrology, let's say, right? So I do feel like some of you guys will actually be getting into it. If you did not start doing it just yet, I feel like you will start getting interested in it more and you might start practicing it here, okay? Now, what I also see for those who are in this field already, um, there might be a period of um i do see money coming in for you but then i do see a stagnant period with the shark over here okay because it's in line together it says take care or there will be a loss of material wealth okay so just be sure guys that um you have some savings when it comes to december and it's not only because of gifts. Um, I feel like you will need a bit of extra money than you would have planned, okay? Now, what I also see happening here, someone will be... That's very interesting. There's a situation here, okay? <laughs> Some of you will have an older man who will be influential in the situation. It says dealings or relationship with an older man. Okay, so for some of you, it can be that person. But for others, what I'm seeing, it seems like there was someone who was watching you on social media and they stopped suddenly and you will be taking interest in them. I feel like you will be getting interested in someone who used to check your social media out, okay? And this might end up being a situation where um, you somehow, would you message this person? Would something happen? There is a situation. I do have two Knights of Cups here. Okay, one of them is reversed. What that's telling me is that someone whom you have known before, and there was a bit of a spark between you two guys, this person will be coming into your life and they will probably be approaching you firstly in a friendly manner and then don't be surprised if they would want to ask you out, all right? And then we have Ace of Wands here, a fresh new spark. By the way, these three cards in line over here, they are talking about a person who is going to be influential in December, okay? So... I do see a situation where someone who who might have seen that they are not interested in the past, they will be showing up in your life and it's like a fresh restart for you guys, okay? And for some of you, it might be someone you used to work with. For some of you, it might be a, a situation where 
previously in this connection wasn't enough give and take and it can not necessarily be romantic okay it can be someone you used to have fun with but maybe one person wasn't putting enough effort in this connection okay and therefore i do feel a renewal of a relationship of some sorts in december okay and it's most probably someone i i know we have an older man here but i'm really picking up for someone this is going to be a younger person okay someone who has a young vibe to them now I do have tower which says it's not the same tower like in tarot it says solid foundation success with effort so something you are working on right now as I speak someone something you're wishing for is going to be granted for you okay in the month of December and I do feel like it's gonna be towards the middle of it okay let me check what it actually is for you guys pile number one let's see what we have here we have seven of wands reversed. All right, bear with me. We have temperance reversed. At one point you, you might have said, you know what? I feel like there is never gonna be a finish line to what I'm doing. Uh, you're seeking for some kind of, um, as it says here, foundation when it comes to your finances, when it comes to your emotional foundation. Uh, you're trying to be stable. Maybe now you are all over the place. And in December, you will be trying to get it back. Six of Pens reversed again. Okay, so for some of you, you don't have this financial stability now as much as you would want to have it, right? All of us probably have the same problem. <laughs> but when it comes to December your finances will be better because it comes next to the tower it's a solid foundation you'll have that pentacle more solid than you have it now okay and I do see like this woman as if she would replace those books with money so that's something to keep in mind for you guys let's see what else we have here let's take your per deck and let's See what else to expect what's good coming in December we have rest or illness so what's good coming is you're probably going to be resting more than you are now and it makes sense with temperance as I said before you will be getting that well-deserved balance in your life finally like a fresh breath of air like okay I can put my feet up all right and then we have a main woman so I do see a couple actually here I was kind of picking up when it comes to this energy if we're talking about romantic or the person coming from the past uh, in the month of December refreshing this relationship you used to have before um, this is a different person that is why I didn't really include the older man that we had over here because older man goes with the main woman and they are the same card for me but it's a couple so this couple it's a married couple we are talking about probably older people than you are yourself a parent type are going to it seems like we have a star it's reversed because it didn't happen yet that's how I take it okay will be granting a wish for you guys so if you have asked someone maybe you hinted someone about something that you would want to do or have that's gonna be happening in the month of december for you and it's gonna be coming from older couple okay might be let's say even your uncle um maybe your dad and mom maybe your grandparents so take it as this more mature energy okay and let me see actually what they're gonna get you i'm really intrigued by this what is it again <laughs> okay this is happiness guys what is going on like okay not even joking, some of you might be um, introduced to someone, actually. And, you know, it's very much like that uh, energy I talked about. For some of you, it's a new person. 
for a lot of you I picked up someone else and your this this couple or this older man or older woman okay I feel like there's gonna be a situation where they go like hey do you remember him or her and then you go yeah I haven't seen you for such a long time and then here you go so it might happen in a family gathering of some sorts or just over dinner or someone comes to visit you um, not directly you but someone from the family and it ends up being a connection okay a bit of an expected connection happening here now um, I'm gonna clarify this we have broken wishbone and it says wish will not be granted and then we have advice from a friend we're gonna see what this wish is about okay Uh, for some of you, I feel like you might be expecting maybe you have really high expectations when it comes to next year. And I'm not talking about December. And I feel like this is your warning saying uh, one step at a time. Do not wish too much. Yeah. One step at a time. Do not wish too much. Okay. Um, do not go crazy. It's... it's um, it's kind of a sign for you saying try not to go over overboard with drinks don't go over overboard with addictions of any sorts would it be sex would it be uh, codependency would it be going out too much okay so um, maybe try and have one one glass less than you you were, you are going to be prepared to have <laughs> okay because it's talking literally about uh, trying not to go overboard with anything in general because it seems like maybe one of the um one of the important things in your life then might suffer from it somehow okay so that's just like your heads up and then advice from a friend there's going to be a friend influential in this situation and this is someone who is um very patient so if you will need any advice in the month of december go to that um earthy type of person okay someone who's super grounded probably has earth somewhere somewhere in their chat they are very wise how they speak but they don't bullshit okay they're not someone who only tells you things that you want to hear they'd be like i don't care that you probably gonna be upset or offended with what I have to say but I'm just gonna tell you this okay because dog is an honest um, creature and therefore it has its mouth open okay over here so that's what you what kind of advice you have to look for in the month of December okay what else we have here I feel like for those who are working in in spiritual fields of any sorts, any career, okay, let's say, or energy healings, whatever it is that you're doing, guys, I feel like it's going to be it's going to be a time when you will be um, saying, okay, I need to kind of take my time a bit from everyone else around you i feel like there's going to be a lot of people around you and you might want to retreat you might want to go within but it's only because you will your intuition will be telling you something is about to happen late in late december okay and what's going to happen is probably you might become really busy and you might have I know it's gonna be Christmas time, right? But I really feel like you might become very busy when it comes to towards end of December. Yeah, collaborations, okay? We have it here, work. So I feel like you'll be pe preparing uh, yourself intuitively. I need to kind of chill out before this next phase, all right? So I hope this has helped out pile number one. Let me know if it did and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Hello people, whoever has chosen this intuitive card over here, let's jump into your reading i know i have a lot of cards here i just need to know a lot of things about your december all right i do see some of you might be suffering from um hmm. i do see you guys carrying too much okay right now and 
this is the indication for you when it comes to putting too much pressure on yourself, when it comes to taking too much on your own shoulders, remember you can split the burden, okay? Ask for help, I know you pile number two, probably someone who's not used to that, doing things on your own, because you are strong and you can, but um, from now on, if you're watching this reading, this is saying, please split the load with people, okay? Don't only carry everything yourself because you'll have to have balance for the month of December. And the sooner you will start working on it, the better it is for yourself. And as I spoke, I looked at the time and it was a 1.11 from the beginning of pile number two, all right? So probably that's gonna be a something that you have seen for some of you guys lately and that's your indication do not suffer alone okay when it comes to uh, finances in the month of december uh, the cards are saying start saving now okay because we have two five of pentacles uh, no that's actually yeah one next to another two five of pentacles but that's not talking about you this i'm gonna tell you what this line over here is okay I do see a situation where someone might need help from you. And that is why you have the five of pentacles here, financial help, okay? Someone might be dependent on you, therefore you might have to spend some extra money. And uh, this line over here column is talking about what's going to be the person who will be influential in the month of December. And I do see someone who's close to you having... Uh, some problems in their life, okay? They will need your help and it's most likely to do with their finances or stability in general and they really, really will need you to somehow support you. Would it be uh, support them? Would it be financially? Would it be emotionally? But this is saying um, you should have a bit extra than you have and you have planned and maybe you wanted to look at pile number one. I think there was something like that there too. But um for you guys, having extra is not for yourself. It seems like there's going to be a situation where you will be in need. Um, and universe will be using you as this uh, helper for this other person who will be in a bad situation. So it's a really good karma. Uh, I do see coming back, coming back for you with the Eight of Wands, okay? Towards the end of December or when it comes to beginning of January, okay? So I not only do see that this person is going to be very like almost, you know, look at this card, almost desperate for help. Okay, maybe they won't want to even ask you for help. But if you will see that there is a situation like this, it's saying you were sent to this person for a reason. Okay, they open up for you for a reason and uh, you are someone probably who is an empath pile number two isn't it so what i do see as i said before your good karma coming back with a knight of cups now for for a lot of you it's going to be this person showing your appreciation back and it's going to be something that you're not expecting this person will bring you more than you would have expected back. And it's going to be a situation in the future in your life where you will be in a place where you need help and this person will be there at the right time and the right moment. And make sure that you don't miss out on the opportunity to help in December, okay? Because it seems like everything is pre-planned for you already. This person will be waiting there for you saying, here, here is my love, you know, I, I remember what you've done to me before, um, what you've done for me before, therefore I appreciate your existence and I will give you everything. He does this guy that seems like he has given his pants to someone else, <laughs> doesn't he? Okay, so that's the situation. I keep paying attention to that and it seems like it's water, okay? So for some of you, maybe that's something... Um, that you like or maybe there is something that has to be cleansed in you and i'm looking at ten of wands and i'm speaking okay take those burdens away from yourself learn how to share let me take a look at the tea leaf tarot okay we're gonna clarify those we do have 
a rat it says someone working against you behind your back so that's like a watch out for you okay when it comes to people make sure that and i said before you probably empaths make sure that you help only those people who sincerely need your help okay your intuition knows anyways okay which is the person that requires your help and um, do not give everything to everyone okay because then you're gonna end up with fear worries and tense situations and some of them are not gonna be even yours and this card literally lines up with the burdens okay that i have talked about so you guys i feel like you put too much pressure on yourself and in the month of december you will be learning how to share the loads and you will be learning how it's okay not to overwork yourself it's okay uh, to ask someone to carry my bags or to ask someone to do a task instead of me at work just because I don't have enough time, okay? Or just to buy me lunch because I'm too busy or to ask my kids to help me out with everyday stuff. Anything to do with that, guys, I feel like you're going to be transitioning in the month of November to a new person when it comes to December. You won't be struggling alone anymore okay we do have tulip and great passion and it nicely sits next to the knight of cups so for some of you the person you might help in the month of december might come back with a proposal of some sorts would you like to go out would you like to would you like to go for dinner there is going to be a person who will somehow turn out to be Unexpected, okay. I keep hearing an unexpected. You might not f uh, think anything on this, of the situation where you're helping someone else, but um, the way they come back to you, it's going to be unexpected. They're gonna be very grateful, and they will want to do more than you have done for them. Okay, remember that. That's the main thing for pile number two. It's like good karma coming back to you guys. Okay, now we do have birth. And it says waiting for news package letter and i would like to clarify that i'm interested in what we're gonna get here okay what's happening taro okay so it's talking about work you might get news if you're waiting for any kind of news from work or from your university when it comes to your career we do have news coming your way okay so probably it's going to be mid or towards the end of december latest beginning of jan okay that i'm seeing things clearing for those who are waiting for any news when it comes to work okay yeah, and I know things might have been stagnant a bit for you guys because, you know, Page of Pentacles is a slow ass guy, okay? Um, I know the Knight of Pentacles is a slow moving guy, but in my case, in this deck, that's how I see the Page of Pentacles. He's a messenger also, but he's someone who it seems like he's been standing, she's been standing there for ages, you know, and she's like, should I go? Should I not? So just be patient when it comes to work, guys. You will get the message you are waiting for, for sure. Okay. Now let's take a look at the tarot again, because I wanted to talk about this um, quite a bit for you guys. Whoever has planned a trip of some sorts in December, it's going to happen and it might happen quicker than you have planned something. Okay. So you might have to leave a day before or you might have to um, leave. For some of you, make sure the trip is long to leave a bit in advance so you don't miss out on anything. But I do see for some of you, we have the chariot here and we have the eight of wands. It's a fast movement, okay? And we do also have yearning and abroad. Also, for some of you, remember number nine is gonna be influential. Ninth or 19th of the month is going to be uh, an important day or date for you guys okay now i do see some of you actually might be going abroad in the month of december not only like a trip to visit your family but actually to another i want to say city but i do see countries in some cases okay it's like abroad abroad overseas kind of so i do see that happening i feel like you are going to finally have 
some time off, which is gonna be nice. For those who are visiting families or going abroad, both of you, uh, scenarios guys you will put your feet up okay and um, you will change your that was reversed you will change the way um, your routine okay in the month of December I know it's Christmas and everything but it feels like before that at the beginning of the month you will be already dealing with life differently I do see your routine massively changing um, and number three might be influential, okay? Number three is also a creative number, so it might mean something to you guys, okay? We have a broken bridge that I wanted to talk about as well. We need to clarify this. It says unsuccessful outcome to a problem. Let's see what this is talking about here. But I feel like it's done and over with for some of you. Let's see. Okay. If you will see that you didn't get an opportunity when it comes to your career or, or a university, okay, or something didn't go the way that you have planned, this card means this wasn't for you. That wasn't yours just yet. There's going to be another chance. So make sure you, you approach it in that way. Do not uh, feel like everything is chaos and things haven't worked out the way I wanted them to work out. Don't think it's unsuccessful. Rather take it as I was saved from this situation, okay? Where this bridge is literally crashing down. So for some of you guys, it might be... You will be getting the message from if you're waiting from workplace or uni. So those who will get it and it's not that what you want to hear, make sure you remember that it's probably not your place to be and take it as this is someone else's position and I need to wait for my turn. Okay, so I hope this has helped pile number two. Let me know if it did and I'll speak to you soon. Hello tribe, whoever has chosen pile number three and this card over here let's jump into it and i do have a lot of cards in front of us we're gonna go through every each of them and also i'll pull more cards as we go so you guys it seems like you're gonna have a really interesting december intuitives who is working in spiritual field any career from healers to tarot readers, mediums, anything to do with that, you will be, you will be successful, okay, you will be getting enough um, income, but it's also, guys, it's more so about you giving from your heart, and because you will be doing this work from your heart, not because of the money it's the quality not quantity for you um you will be receiving a really good feedback back okay and also your income is going to be better but it's more so i'm feeling my heart heart matters and i looked at Le lion so maybe some of you are leos i wasn't planning to talk about signs but it seems like someone will be working from their heart and therefore they will be getting um, a lot of good karma back, okay? Especially career-wise here, guys. Now, if you have anything planned uh, when it comes to a trip or a visitation of some sort, make sure that you are making this trip because you want to yourself and it's something that's positive rather than someone told you so, okay? I do see a situation here with the devil that maybe you will be pushed to take a trip or go somewhere, not necessarily a trip, go somewhere that you might not want to go and therefore we have scales here in the same column saying keep your life in balance so this is saying whatever it is that you will be doing in december make sure you do it from your from your heart everything in pile number three has to be done from your heart otherwise the karma will kick you in the ass <laughs> it's not that you will be doing anything wrong guys here it's more so coming through like the more hard you'll be putting in without expectations of anything back, the more you will get in the month of December, okay? So remember that. Uh, 
put your heart in everything that you do. Some of you will be dealing with a fair woman we have here dealings or relationship with a woman with blonde gray or white hair and it might be someone's friend or sister i'm picking up uh, maybe cousin for some of you um let me find out how this person will be influential for you let me see i feel like for some of you this um person will come to visit you or you're going to see them in the month of no, um, December sorry uh, and it's going to be a great fun I really get friend vibes from this lady over here and you will have a really good get together someone is gonna message someone one of you guys or you or you them or them will send a message to you and uh, therefore you will get together and you'll have an amazing time I do see only two of you guys, even though I know there might be more people involved in the month of December if you're talking about Christmas, but when it comes to this situation, I only do see you two catching up so you're further away from everyone else and it's going to be a really good time, okay? Now, on this side over here, we do have these three cards from my Texture Tarot talking about who is going to be... what person will be influential in the month of December in general for you and we do have at the bottom over here two of cups so for some of you this is someone you dearly appreciate or love and I do see that this person is super chilled and super hard working person okay they have worked everything that they have okay they have worked for everything that they have and they have worked with the stamina with patience everything that they have and they're just really honest in general they are not cocky they are not proud this is someone who has earned all of that luxury behind her uh, but that's not that what's important to her here she's just meditating um planning her next steps she has it all but it seems like if you took everything away from her she's so peaceful that she wouldn't even care about it so that's what kind of person we are talking about for some of you uh, this person will possibly offer you a new job of some sort or introduce you to someone who might offer you something new something fresh that you will be really happy about and that might happen unexpectedly and really quick we have two eight of wands over here from two different necks what are the chances and then ace of pens and then eight of pentacles they all connected okay expect unexpected when it comes to your career and it's all good okay you have a really good person who's going to be super supportive and super encouraging of in the month of november for some of you it's your lover for some of you it's just a really dear friend a family member a soul member soul tribe okay <laughs> one of them people and they're going to be um offering you to start something fresh and new so make sure you don't miss out on opportunities in the month of December okay for some of you it might feel like too many things at once but um, understand that when December will be finishing beginning of Jan everything will start coming down and therefore the opportunity that opportunity that you were offered is not gonna seem so chaotic anymore because you will have a lot of things resolved by then okay Whew, I feel like I was talking a lot here. Let me see what else we have here. Um, we have family sorrow and I want to take a look at this one. Clarify with tarot. It says weeping willow, family sorrow. So let's see what's happening here for you guys. But we do have lion right below it. And it, for me, this is saying that whatever happens in your family whatever problems you will have in the month of december you will be that strong person that everyone will turn to and it's going to be your time to act okay as it says here your time to be a leader and i feel like you're going to shine in this situation whatever is going to happen when it comes to family matters here let me see what that has to do with Okay, for some of you, it might be to do with your dad. There is a situation here. Let me see what's that. Okay, one second. 
Um, I do see someone's dad running late to something important over here and therefore everyone sees it as a problem and maybe you are someone who's like, it's fine, you know, we, we can, sorry guys, my music finished, that's what happens when I do tarot, like everything just stops working, mediumship is even worse, <laughs> so someone is waiting for a family member who might be late or who might not show up on on set time or who might not be able to make it somewhere i do see that happening okay with the two of wands here and someone is going to be family sorrow heartbroken about this so maybe there is a lot of expectation from someone put in the month of december on some kind of a plan okay make sure if any family member has any problems with heart that they are they check themselves and you know take i'm not warning you here like it's nothing bad but i'm just saying someone needs to be cautious of how they treat their bodies when it comes to stress because i feel like someone might be really stressed in the month of december someone around you okay and therefore uh, they have to watch out for their heart because it seems like their heart might be suffering from the stress all right or from literally someone sees a problem when there is no problem really okay someone creates that problem therefore it all reflects on their health so make sure that's not you, that's not your family member. And as I was saying that, I drew the hair fan, which is a, someone who's older than you, okay? A parent, a mentor of some sort, someone who is wiser and who is older than you are. So we are talking about maybe even one of your grandparents here, okay? Make sure that they chill, they are not stressed, and everyone is literally not overreacting no one has to overreact when it comes to your family members okay in the month of december we have emotions coming through here it says let it flow okay whatever happens uh don't be emotional it came out reversed and it's talking not as much about you for some of you it can be it's talking about um a family member some of you it can be your husband who is married okay so make sure you are aware of this Let's see what else we have over here. I'm gonna take, um, I'm gonna be nosy. I'm gonna check who is this person who's super patient, very loving, and will be um, bringing you news of some sorts or opportunity, okay? Who is this person? This is someone who likes to travel. Okay, we have the world card. And I keep looking at her hair here. So someone who has really voluminous or really nice hair. Doesn't matter um, about the color. Don't look at that. But look at the volume of that person's hair. Someone who have walked away recently from a situation. Let's see what they walked away from. But they've done it in a calculated manner. Okay, from, um, from someone who is... Uh, who is very logical and straight to the point, and maybe that's why they had an argument. Um, there was a discussion of some sorts, maybe words were uh, a little bit harsh when it comes to communication. For some of you, it's going to be um, a person who has walked away from someone who was a friend or even a family member in some cases, but it's more so a friend or cousin vibe that I'm getting here. I'm not really getting family for a lot of you guys away here. This person is someone who has decided, you know, they were like, it's literally four of swords here. For me, it's very similar, like my eight of pentacles. Do you see how it goes? She's very chilled and this is a very chilled person just laying there on the couch. So this person, literally someone who has walked away from drama recently, that's how you can recognize them, who's going to be coming in in the month of December um, to bring you good news or opportunity of some sorts when it comes to new beginnings. But it's more so to do with your career or uh, university or anything to do of that sort, okay? So I hope that has helped out. Pile number three, and I'm going to speak to you soon. Bye.